This is the Car Seatbelt Emergency Alerting System, which is a project developed by Team One Technology. The system consists of a microcontroller, which is an Arduino Uno, and three basic sensors, which are the flame detector, the inflammable gas sensor, and the heartbeat sensor. All of them are connected to the Arduino, where the data can be received, processed, and then sent via Bluetooth to a special Android app for monitoring and reporting. In this video, we're going to do a demonstration about the functionality of the system. So we're going to start with the flame detector. We try to include the GSM module to the system, so once the signal is received by the flame detector, it activates the GSM module to send text messages and make phone calls to the emergency number. We try to use the SIM 800L module, but unfortunately it did not work, even with the extended antenna, it did not receive any signal, maybe because of incompatibility with the service provider in our region. So, for the sake of this demonstration, we try to use a different approach. We used this feature phone and we modified it. We activated the speed dial number 5, so once the signal is received by the flame detector, it activates the speed dial and initiates a phone call to, for example, an emergency number. Now, let's start the demo. the sensor the speed dial is activated and the phone call is initiated okay now for the other two sensors the data can be viewed and monitored in the uh, special Android app that we developed and uh, here is how the app looks This is the user interface of the application. First thing to do is to connect the application to the Bluetooth of the system. Once it's connected, the data will be viewed here at this part of the screen. Here in the middle, you insert an emergency email. And all the data report viewed in this application is automatically saved in a text file in the storage of the phone. So uh, just to review what's already been saved, you just click open file here. And if you want to report it by email, just click send a report and it will send directly to this emergency email that you put in here. So let's connect. And as you see, it's reporting the data from these two sensors. For the inflammable gas sensor, uh, we're going to test how it works. It actually gives value about the content of inflammable gases in the environment. So I'm going to spray uh, propellant gas when you can monitor how the value increases. It's exceeding 300 and more. So yes. Now for the heart rate sensor, it actually gives rubbish data, but to make it work, you just have uh, to touch the sensor with your skin and wait for a few seconds until it reaches a constant value, which is 77. So if you want to uh, review what's already been saved everything shows up in here and you just have to insert an email and you want to report the data to this email you click send a report and it sends an email to this predetermined one so let's check if it's already been sent okay I got it here is the data 
sent by email. This was a demonstration about the functionality of the system and thank you for watching.